In this part, we'd like to explain the anesthesia machine behavior in case of an emergency start. If the Fabius GS Premium is switched off completely and you need immediate access to ventilation, the only thing you need to do is to turn on the oxygen flow. The fresh gas is now directed to the breathing system and you can manually ventilate the patient using the APL valve, short for Adjustable Pressure Limitation Valve, and the breathing bag. If needed, you can add air, nitrous oxide, or anesthetic agents to the fresh gas mixture. You can now switch on the Fabius GS Premium. It will perform a brief system test and will go to Manspond. All the time, you can continue to manually ventilate. Then you can select an automatic ventilation mode. If the device is already in standby or in sleep mode when you turn on a fresh gas flow, Fabius GS Premium automatically wakes up and starts the Manspond ventilation mode. You can then manually ventilate the patient or directly start an automatic ventilation mode, for example, pressure-controlled ventilation. You simply press the key to adjust the ventilation parameters and confirm via the rotary knob. As both the compliance leakage test and the flow sensor calibration cannot be done with a patient connected, perform the complete self-test as soon as practicable. If the Fabius GS Premium indicates that the oxygen sensor calibration is due, you can perform this at any time during operation by pressing Setup and following the instructions on the screen.